Bang bang bang! In this video, I wanna show you this thing. Because I was planning to record it. Because I haven't actually done that very much since I got it. I've mainly like shown it to my friends. Like, hey, haha, try this thing. You will be surprised. But yeah, as you probably know, I'm a huge fan of melodicas. I don't know why you would probably know that, actually. As some of you may know, I'm a big fan of melodicas. I put it in a lot of my music, like putting down chords and stuff like that to get that. Like, it's got such a nice sound. A lot of overtones, in my opinion. I've even made videos with an electric one. I'm not actually gonna show you that one. It's always plugged in, so I can always turn it on. Actually, maybe you can hear it. It's got a fan on the inside. I, th I call it the worst instrument ever invented. But I think this might top that, actually. <laughs> Funny enough. Oh yeah. Sounds really nice when you play it. You just have to EQ or filter out the fan sound. But, yeah. I've got a couple of melodicas, and I even have a bass one, actually, which is really cool. It doesn't have a mouthpiece at the moment. I haven't done a video with that either. I can really recommend. Pretty expensive, though, but this one is even more expensive. And what this one is, brrr, drum roll, is... Uh, really dumb but it's kind of smart also because it's a flute melodica so it's like a flute but with a keyboard and i think we're gonna maybe open it up and have a look inside very medieval It's like a national anthem for a country I've never been to? Or what? Yeah, Leonard in the Cohen, I guess. I don't know what the fuck I just played. Anyways, really cool, right? On a surface level, at least. So what I've been doing is I've been going through all, all my songs that I'm working on, just listening to them. Like, yeah. And then trying to be like, will this fit? Actually kind of fits I think we're gonna record but yeah you know what a flute is right or a recorder you know like one of these this one is compensating for something as you can hear I'm a fantastic flute player uh, I'm doing it for many, many years, I got my first one when I was like five, and yeah, I went to school for it, and I suck. But I still like to record it. I put it in a lot of songs, actually, because it's a very clean sound uh, that really, yeah, adds to it. Like, if you don't, I'm not playing like a solo melody in the center of a mix. It's a can't, but I'm putting like, sounds, huge reverb. Flies away in the left ear or something. Someone actually texted me about this one on Instagram. Like, hey, have you seen this? So I saved up money because it's super expensive. Like 300 bucks, I think it cost me. Uh, <laughs> not very nice. You can get a lot of better things for that amount of money. But I, I'm very invested. So I got myself a flute with keys. So my guess... Because I can kind of see it on the inside. Is that there is a flute here? There's a lot of flutes here, actually, because I can do poly. <laughs> Can't do that with 
the flute. So all of a sudden the high price makes a lot of sense. Well, yeah, I can sort of play keys or at least I don't miss the keys to the same extent and make it like go crazy. Maybe this can't even go crazy. It can. If my neighbors are watching this, I apologize. <laughs> but I think we're gonna try putting it in songs. That's what I wanna do. But I also wanna maybe put some bass melodica in the song also. I don't know if this one, I might switch around as far as project goes, but this is a fun project. I have no idea when I started it, but I'm pretty sure I did. So we see what we can do. Okay. Not, not, not half bad actually. Through a mic. <laughs> Almost cool. What if we pitch it down an octave? <laughs> Okay. That's kind of a cool sound. I forgot to show you this. I actually have had something very similar before. This is a really cool thing that doesn't really fit to put, like to make its own video. I just need to grab batteries for it. So it's the same thing, flute. But like, in combination with, you know, the fan organ. So this might actually be the absolutely worst instrument ever invited by anyone. Invited? Invented. But it can autoplay with these records that has like dots on it, so it, yeah, makes it play. <laughs>
have officially made music with your little auto playing flute toy. Very nice. <laughs> play this all day but let's open it up first and have a little bit of a look see on the inside maybe i can hack it <laughs> okay. maybe that was stupid as i suspect then that's like that's the smallest flute i've ever seen up here If you have any good idea for how, what to do, then please, please let me know. <laughs> uh, I need to call my mom. Maybe I could DIY on myself. That would for real probably be cheaper to buy. 25 of these and also just a little bit of housekeeping I guess before we actually end end it magpie pedals Woohoo things that I make that I want to sell you <laughs> So thank you if you buy uh, very nice of you all kinds of stuff uh, At this point also link in the description to the almost viral podcast shout out analog weapon We have a great podcast together and also I want to say that the magpie fest it's coming up soon. It's like an online festival put up by the Magpie Pirates community. So there's a link to the Magpie Pirates community. If you, I don't know if they're accepting people, like more people for for playing the show, but maybe. So if you want to play on this online festival or you just join and then you play next fest, that could be really cool too. But yeah, to get all the information, link to Magpie Pirates is in the description and it's going to be on the Magpie Pirates YouTube channel. So go there and check that out because I want you to at least watch it. I'm gonna watch it. So if you wanna be like me, you gotta watch stuff or listen to it since it's the music. I think that's it as far as housekeeping goes. So thank you for watching. This was <laughs> just me and my flute. <laughs> it's a great EP name. Bye.